Let me show you what I do every time I want to connect my phone to my TV and it won't connect. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to be using two different phone models and that's because some phones don't have the same settings. I'm going to start off with this Xiaomi phone, then I will use a Samsung to show you the process. So to start guys, let's open the settings, scroll the way down until you see apps. Let's go ahead and click on apps. Now let's go ahead and click on manage apps. Keep in mind, if you don't see the same settings that I'm showing right now, just wait for, you know, until I use the Samsung Galaxy to show you. All right, guys, right here, let's go ahead and click on those three dots at the top. Then let's go ahead and click on show all apps. All right, now let's search for this app that called Cast, just like that. Cast, as you can see, just open the app, then scroll the way down until you see this setting, app permissions. Let's go ahead and click on that. Now let's go ahead and click on nearby devices and just allow that setting guys. Just click on allow, just go back, go back. Then let's go ahead and click on this setting, restrict data usage. And guys, right here, make sure that setting is off. Then click okay. Now just restart your phone. You know, press the power button and restart. Don't turn off your phone. Click on restart or reboot. So just wait until your phone turn it back on to show you what else you need to do. Okay, unlock your phone. Then let's go ahead and click on settings. Open the settings. Now let's go ahead and click on Wi-Fi. And just make sure before start connecting your phone, just make sure your phone is on the same Wi-Fi network as your TV, okay? So once you confirm that, just go back, open the control panel, swipe to the right, and you will see the app right here, Cast. Let's go ahead and open it. And your phone will start searching for TV. So you will see all the TV that you have on your on the same Wi-Fi network. If you don't see any TV right here, you will have to do something else to fix it. Just um, open the settings. Scroll the way down until you see apps. Now let's go ahead and click on manage apps. All right. Now you're going to search for the cast app one more time. Just, you know, type in cast, open the app, scroll the way down until you see clear data. Just click on that and right here, you're going to clear data and clear cache. Just like that. And the last step, just restart your phone. Press the power button, restart your phone one more time. When your phone turns back on, just, you know, make sure your phone is connected on the same Wi-Fi network and just, you will see, your phone will start working. That's what I do every time I'm having this problem on my phone. And, you know, I use my phone every day connected to my TV. And sometimes I face that problem and that's how I fix it. Now, if you have another phone, let me show you how to fix it. We have to make sure this app is working perfectly. So in order for our phone to connect to any TV, this app has to be running perfectly, guys. And that's all you have to do. On your Samsung Galaxy phone, let's go ahead and open the settings. Then scroll the way down until you see apps. Let's go ahead and open the setting. Then you will see these three lines right here that you can barely see. Let's go ahead and click on that. And right here, let's go ahead and click on show system apps because, you know, on Samsung Galaxy devices, we use this app to connect the phone to the TV, Smart View. And for you to see that app on this section, you will have to enable show system app. Then just search for the app, Smart View. Okay, let's go ahead and open the app. Now scroll the way down until you see battery. And just make sure, guys, you have the first setting selected on your phone. So if it is optimized or restricted, just change that setting to the first setting, unrestricted. Then go back. Let's go ahead and click on change system settings and allow this setting on your phone. Permissions. And just make sure, guys, this setting nearby device is selected is on, on your phone. You need to allow this app, you know, to find, obviously, nearby devices. So just allow that setting. And after that, just restart your phone. Press the power button and restart the phone. All right, my phone is already on. Let me go ahead and open the settings. On your phone, you're going to do the same thing. Let's open the settings. Now let's go ahead and click on connections, Wi-Fi. Just make sure to connect your phone on the same Wi-Fi network as your TV. Now, let's say you still have the same problem. Your phone is not connecting to your TV. Let's do this. Open the settings on your phone. Scroll the way down until you see apps. Same thing. Open the search bar and now type in Smart View. Smart View. If you don't see the app right here, remember you have to click on this menu to enable show system apps. Okay. Then just search for the app Smart View. Open the app. Scroll the way down until you see storage. 
and clear the data and clear the cache. And after, restart your phone one more time. Just restart your phone. And, you know, once your phone turns back on, guys, just make sure your phone is connected on the same Wi-Fi network as your TV. And you will see your phone will start, you know, uh, your phone will start finding TV on the same Wi-Fi network. If that still doesn't work, remember, you know, turning off your Wi-Fi router, that also helps a lot. Just turn off your router, leave it off for a few minutes, 15 minutes the most. And then after that, turn your router back on and just connect your devices on the same Wi-Fi network. And you will see, guys, everything will work perfectly. If you like this video, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe.